a hydration pack or water bladder that I've been using for the last three years. So I want to review it today for those of you who are in the market for a new one or perhaps you're just curious about the features of this one right here. Now, when you order your Osprey hydration pack, the packaging is very straightforward to unpack. And so there are mainly two pieces in here. The first one is the actual hydration pack. And then the second piece is the hose. So what I'm gonna do right here, there is a quick release system. All you have to do is click the red button in here to detach both of them. So I'm gonna leave the hose aside and we'll talk first of all about the pack itself. So this is a three liter hydration pack that's about 100 ounces. And you can see the grading system going from 0.5 liters all the way to three liters. And then there is another mark for the max fill. So when you are filling this hydration pack with water, you wanna make sure that you are not getting to the max fill because there might be some leakage. Hydration pack is made by the company Hydro pack and they had a collaboration going on with the Osprey and so that's why you will see the branding as Osprey and then Hydra pack in the back in here. So the first feature for this uh, hydration pack is the slider or the seal and this is the mechanism used to open and close the hydration bladder. So all you have to do when you are buying a new one is to slide it all the way to the right and you can see right here that there is um, a piece of plastic that's connecting the seal to the hydration pack, this way you don't lose it. And so you unfold and then from here, you will notice in the beginning when you are buying a new one that these two pieces of plastic are going to be pretty much glued. So it might be difficult to open or separate them, but if it's the case, just apply more pressure by placing your uh, middle finger in here and your thumb in here and then just apply pressure and you will be able to open it. Obviously mine, I've been using it for a couple of years, so that's not an issue. And this is the opening where you will be filling water. So you fill it with water up until three liters or maybe less, depending on how long your hike is. And then when you want to close it, all you have to do is fold, make sure it's secure. And then again, use the slider place it properly and slide all the way to the other side. And obviously you wanna make sure that you are moving it upside down to make sure that it's not leaking. So that's feature number one. The second feature is this handle right here with the blue piece. It helps you have better control over the hydration pack if you want to carry it or move it from one place to the other or even just hold it like this when you are filling it with water. And it's got two holes right here. This is a routing system that will allow you to choose whether you want this hose right here to run left or right. So if I want to move it to the other side, all I have to do is detach this piece right here and then move it to the other side through the hole and then attach the other piece. And there we go. So that's that. Obviously there is the hose that will allow for water to flow to the external hose that's going to feed directly to you or to your mouth. And then the other nice feature about this uh, hydration pack, there is this piece of plastic, the gray one, and it's really useful because it helps the hydration pack have a form and it also makes it easier for you to slide it and place it in uh, a backpack that is already full. So this feature right here is not available in all hydration packs like this old one I have right here. You can see there's nothing in the back and so it was a little bit difficult for me to make sure that I can fit it nicely in a heavy or a full backpack. So this um, back plate right here is really helpful. And yeah, it just makes it very easy for you to fit it into a backpack that's already full with your gear. The next feature is this hole in here and I'm going to show you how this is going to be useful. I do have a couple of videos up here and I talk about all of the methods that I use in order to maintain it and keep it clean over time. Now let's move to talk about the hose. The first piece of the hose right here is this one that connects to the quick release. So once you have the hydration pack inserted in your backpack, then you worry about connecting these two pieces and you just wanna make sure that it's inserted all the way until you hear a click just like this one. And then the other piece of the hose is this bite valve system. This is the system that will allow you to drink water. And all you have to do is to turn it quarter the way 
to the right or to the left to either open or close then you obviously want to make sure that you are applying some pressure with your mouth in order for you to drink so most of the pieces right here like this red piece in here and then the external plastic piece they are detachable and I talk about this in the same video up here and I show you how you can remove them and clean them if you want to the other nice thing about this hood is this piece of magnet right here it's really useful and let me show you how so let's imagine you are wearing your hydration pack in your backpack now you have the hose running all the way to the right right here this is going to be annoying imagine if you are hiking or backpacking it's annoying if it's going to keep moving to the right and the left so with this piece of magnet right here you will be able to connect it to another piece that's attached to your backpack. So instead of having the hose just like dancing and doing this thing in here, it will be attached to your chest and you will have an easy and better access to drink water with less effort. So that's that. So now that we talked about that, let's imagine that this is filled with water, which is pretty straightforward. In case you have any questions about filling it with water, let me know. Um, now I'm going to demonstrate with my 20 liter Osprey Tempest. This is the backpack that I take out with me for day hikes. And so there is a compartment in this backpack that is dedicated specifically for the hydration bladder. So all I have to do I want to make sure that the hose first of all is disconnected so that it's easy for me and then I want to make sure that the back side is facing this way and then all I'll have to do is slide it. So I slide my backpack. Now remember when we talked about this little hook in here? Some of the Allspray backpacks have a system that you can run through this hole to make sure that uh, the hydration pack is well placed. That's what I'm going to do right here. I'm going to run this piece through the hole. Just secure it like this. Clip it in. And there you go. So that is very well inserted in the backpack. And then once you have it inserted, I get the hose right there. And I connect it to the other piece. And voila. So there we go. I hope that you guys found this video to be useful. And if you did, please give it a 